The Panzer SM represents a recent advancement in Russian short-range air defense technology. It is an enhanced iteration of the original Panzer S1, which was adopted in 2007. This upgraded version features new missiles, an upgraded radar system, and various other enhancements. Additionally, it operates on a new chassis. The first unit of the improved Panzer SM was constructed in 2017, and its public debut took place in 2019. The Panzer SM is built upon a specialized wheeled chassis known as the K53958, essentially derived from the Kamaz 6560M military truck but with an armored cabin. While this air defense system is adaptable to different chassis options, it can also be employed as a stationary module or installed on naval vessels. Primarily designed for safeguarding specific targets, the Panzer SM is geared toward stationary applications. The system incorporates an advanced active electronically scanned array radar, greatly enhancing its detection range to 75 kilometers. This represents a significant improvement compared to the original Panzer S1's 36 km range. The new radar is also designed to resist jamming more effectively. The Panzer SM introduces a novel missile with a maximum range of 40 km and an altitude reach of 15 km. This is double the range and altitude capability of the Panzer S1's 57 times 10 to the power of 6 missile. Consequently, the Panzer SM functions as both a short-range and medium-range air defense system. These new missiles travel at a notably higher speed, approximately Mach 8.7, 10,800 km per hour. It's likely that the Panzer SM is also compatible with the older 57 times 10 to the power of 6 missiles. Furthermore, Plans were laid out for the Panzer SM to employ a new type of smaller missile designed to engage UAVs, drones, mortar shells, and artillery rockets. Each missile container could house four of these smaller missiles. Operational experience with the original Panzer S1 in Syria revealed its limitations against smaller, slow-moving targets like small UAVs. The Panzer SM is equipped with dual 30mm guns that can fire at a combined rate of up to 5,000 rounds per minute. These guns can effectively engage targets up to 4 km away and can even utilize armor-penetrating ammunition against armored vehicles, although this capability is primarily intended for self-defense. The system carries a total of 1,400 rounds for these guns. The air defense system has the capacity to launch missiles while on the move, but the cannons can only be fired when the vehicle is stationary. Notably, the new Panzer SM does not feature stabilizing jacks. The baseline Panzer SM configuration holds 12 missiles in sealed containers, while a variant with 24 missiles but no guns was also considered. The armored cabin of the Panzer SM provides crew protection against small arms fire, artillery shell fragments, and blasts equivalent to 2 kilograms of TNT. Operated by a crew of three, commander, operator, and driver, the K53958 special wheel chassis is equipped with a turbocharged diesel engine generating 600 horsepower. This engine is paired with an automatic transmission, allowing the vehicle to traverse off-road terrain. Each Panzer SM unit is capable of independent operation, with up to three to five combat vehicles forming a battery. In this configuration, one vehicle serves as a command post, relaying target data to the others. These combat vehicles can also collaborate with an air defense command post and receive data from early warning radars. A standard battery includes a variety of support vehicles such as reloaders, maintenance units, and mobile workshops. In 2022, the Russians unveiled a modified launcher vehicle model for the Panzer SM system featuring 24 missiles. This vehicle, however, lacks the search radar and guns, instead relying on targeting data from nearby Panzer SM systems or command post vehicles.